Hello, I'm Dr. Rachel Haverland and I'm answering questions. Today our question from you is, how often is endometriosis identified outside of the pelvis? And we call this extra pelvic disease. And it's actually very common, more common than you might think. It's just very important for your surgeon to be able to look for it and identify it. So areas that endometriosis has been found, there's case studies of it being found in the nose, in the brain, in the thoracic cavity around your lungs. More commonly, if it's found in the in the thoracic cavity more commonly on the right, but you can also have endometriosis that's been found in the stomach, for example, the abdominal wall. A lot of the times you can feel abdominal wall masses. This can be spread from C-sections, from prior endometriosis laparoscopies, some that's spread without having surgery, but sometimes if it's on the abdominal wall, you can feel, you can feel a mass underneath the skin. They may have cyclic bleeding from these areas as well. Our studies show that Maybe 12%, up to 15% of endometriosis is found outside of the pelvis, but it's important to make sure that your surgeon knows how to identify it and more importantly, to look for it.